Georgians sacrificed a lot to prepare us for this moment right now, where if we had another uptick, we could handle it. And we are certainly handling it in our hospitals. Governor Kemp wrapping up a statewide tour, urging people to wear masks to prevent the further spread of the coronavirus. The governor even spoke about the possibility of no college football if Georgians fail to wear their masks. CBS 46's Adam Murphy continues our team coverage tonight. You're outside of Bobby Dodd Stadium on the Georgia Tech campus. Give us the latest. Good evening, Adam. Good evening, Sean. That's right. Governor Kemp set out on a seven city statewide tour, urging everyone to wear face masks. And he did go so far, as you mentioned, to say that if people do not wear these masks, college football season could be in jeopardy. And that's a big concern for many here on the Georgia Tech campus and throughout other campuses around the state. The governor made it clear that if COVID cases continue to rise as they have recently and Georgians don't follow public health guidelines, fall sports on college campuses could be canceled. Having said that, Governor Kemp has been hesitant about implementing a statewide mandatory mask policy. Instead, he signed an order saying that masks are strongly encouraged and encouraged everyone to wear them, but that's as far as he would go with it. Now, the city of Savannah became the first in the state to mandate the use of face coverings with an order that took effect early Wednesday. As the governor said, he will not go so far as to mandate that statewide at this point in time, but again, he is encouraging everyone to take responsibility on their own here and wear these masks. If you're ready for some football in the fall, as I've told my daughters, you know, they keep asking me, Dad, do you think we're going to have college football? You know, surely we got to have the season. And I said, well, if people, especially our young people, don't start wearing a mask when they're going out in public and our numbers keep rising, that's going to be a tall task. But if we all hunker down right now and dig in for the next two or three weeks and get this turned in the right direction like it was, and we could do the exact same thing with the number of cases that we're seeing in our fatality rate right now. I mean, it is on a solid downward trajectory. That is what we need for our case count. Now, I reached out to the athletic departments at the University of Georgia, Georgia Tech, Georgia State, to find out what they plan to do about wearing masks at sporting events in the fall. Georgia Tech got back to me. They said they plan to play sports in the fall, and they don't have any reason at this point not to do so, and they are evaluating all of the options including the possibility of fans having to wear masks, but they have not made a final call on that. We'll stay on top of this one. We're live on the Georgia Tech campus here in downtown Atlanta. Adam Murphy, CBS 46 News.